you know, a lot of players uh, drafted in the early 1970s were uh, had a good chance to make the NHL. Uh, this guy uh, had as much opportunity as anybody else. But I think what really uh, stopped him was a very unforeseen incident in his uh, draft year that drew international attention, not because he did something right, but technically he did something wrong. Now, Mike Leggy was drafted by the Minnesota North Stars in the fourth round, 49th overall, in the 71 amateur draft. Now, this came after a strong uh, career with the Winnipeg Jets, the original Winnipeg Jets of the WCHL in 1971, where he put up 30 points, including 14 goals in 65 games. Everybody was talking about this player because, you know, he seemed uh, to, to have, uh, have it going for him. He played with St. James of the WJHL, so uh, the two-sport star, he also excelled at baseball. Seemed to be, you know, have it made. Now, his, his opening season, he had to miss pretty much. After recovering from a 100-stitch cut on, a, on his leg, an injury suffered while attempting to climb a flagpole in July of 1971. So... Uh, I don't know exactly what transpired, but word got around. He wasn't extremely careful while it were for any reason why he was trying to do the flagpole. Uh, the only thing that could hook up into was what he called the latch for the flag at the bottom of the flagpole, but eventually, uh, you know, uh, stopped his uh, early career in its tracks. Now, he, f he played nine games with the Clinton Comets that year with two assists. And five games of the playoffs, so we, he he came back for the postseason. Seventy three, put up some decent numbers with Saginaw of the IHL. Then moved on to Columbus Owls and the Columbus Port Huron squads the next two seasons. Then eventually found himself uh, in the, with the Milwaukee Grand Rapids program of the USHL uh, in seventy seven with eighteen points in forty games. Big player, six foot four, uh, two uh, two hundred and ten. You know, more than decent size. Now, Grand Rapids did win the USH, USHL regular season playoff titles that year, but it was not with the team during the playoffs. Now, if the word uh, leggy sounds familiar, uh, the Winnipeg Manitoba native is the older brother of former NHL player Barry Leggy, who uh, basically had, uh, had uh, great uh, success with, uh, with several teams. And uh, you know what? He could go for twins uh, with both of them. Now, Barry, of course, Barry, if you know his history, came up with the Winnipeg Jets program uh, of the WCHL a year after his uh, brother was drafted and eventually was in the NHL for a number of years. I mean, the WHA for a number of years and eventually found his way to the, uh, to the Jets of the NHL. And Barry was a Montreal Canadiens uh, draft pick as well. So a highly regarded family, as, as we well know. And the podcast of Barry is already on our uh, channel here, so check it out. So that's the Curious Case of Mike Leggy. Thanks for listening. Bye.